After a rainy day yesterday, it is gorgeous today. So I got to run a bunch of errands for No Small November, just groceries in general and that kind of stuff. I have a partner in crime today. Nato, you ready for some Starbucks? Yeah? Mm -hmm. You ready to go? Yeah. Okay, let's go. Let's do this thing. <laughs> <laughs> let's do this thing. Yeah, Cody. Cinco Grande Americano coming up. On the vlog, I was talking about zippers on jackets. This is exactly what I'm talking about. So when I, when I sit down, the zippers are all over my face and it just, it, yeah, doesn't do anything good for my skin. If anybody knows of a zipper alternative, let me know. Made it through Starbucks and we're getting a little kooky in the car right now with the uh, I did I did the I did the Cinco Grande Americano. Natty's got her kids cocoa and we were just singing songs and stuff and she's a big fan of this song. It's become a dance party staple for us. Ready? Ready Natto? Focus. Focus. <laughs> I love it. Let's get some groceries. My review of the Cinco Grande Americano from Starbucks, uh, just, it'll completely stimulate your brain beyond. It's not gonna be a regular thing for sure, but I will say there's gonna be days where it calls for a Cinco versus a quad or a regular. I have a bunch of stuff in back here. Our old microwave, I'm finally, the dump is open so I can recycle it there. They have a recycling thing so I can actually go and, and dispose of it properly then i'm going to go to the storage unit then i gotta head to costco then i'm going to try to hit the hardware store and i'm just continuing on my no small november project today maureen got a little bit of rest today she's been a trooper now she's awake and with the kiddos and stuff so i can do some running around but um yeah just kind of a trying to catch up kind of day but i do want to update you on my no small november challenge Just got done at the dump, made it to the storage unit and realized that I have Maureen's car and on her key ring, she doesn't have our storage room key. So I'm gonna have to bail on the storage unit at the moment and do that later. Heading to Costco right now. Uh, yeah, what can you do? I have access to this place 24 seven, so. <clears throat> we'll just put it on the agenda for later, I guess. Costco time. Made it to Costco. Fun fact about our Costco. This Costco used to be an Amana appliance factory. So the parking lot is actually indoors where the production floor used to be. So in the winter time, even if we only have to get like one little thing, we come here because any of the parents out there, you'll feel me like 10 times easier to get kids out of the car when you don't have to be outside. So yeah, we come here a lot. It's huge though, check this out. To keep rolling. Cody Cinco Grande Americano. Uh, the jury's out now because I almost passed out in Costco. Could be because I haven't eaten enough today or something, but whew, my body's like, my body's freaking out right now. <laughs> Finally heading back. Whoop. Brighter than my car. Finally heading back to the storage unit. The girls are in bed, loaded up a little extra stuff now that I had some more room. Gonna make a quick trip there and I figured out what today's takeaway is. And I wanna talk about growth as a daily vlogger. Let's head back to storage. <laughs> oh 
apologize for shooting so much footage at this storage unit, but right now, part of the snow small November, that's just kind of where I'm at right now. Speaking of no small November, I'll give you a quick update on the fitness journey. Eh, Thanksgiving, everything else. I haven't been to the gym nearly as much as I want, but December is almost here, and come December, I'll make it happen. Quick office update. Right now, the office is eh also, but there's a lot of moving parts. I really know what Casey feels like when he's like, I want to show everybody what's going on but it just doesn't look like a lot's going on, but there's a lot of moving parts behind the scenes. It's kind of where I'm at with the office studio right now. I have to actually move my current office down, put some stuff here in storage. I have to do all that stuff before I even start like the real construction side of it. Between that, traveling the next couple weeks, and now the new hashtag, there's a lot going on with that too. Um, just a lot of stuff going on and I'm rearranging my priorities a little bit. No small November it might change up a little bit, but it'll be for good reason. This vlog's a little all over the place, I apologize, but I, Cody, that Cinco Grande Americano, this is kind of what happens when you drink one of those to start your day. Today's takeaway, I want to get back to it. I want to talk about YouTube growth as a daily vlogger. One trend I've noticed with all the daily vloggers that I interact with and that I've watched for a long time, like Casey and everybody, is it, it seems like if you're a daily vlogger, your growth is going to be like a staircase. You kind of start at the bottom and, and you, you hone your skills in, you just kind of document, document, and then all of a sudden you have that one video kind of spikes you up a little bit and it, it resonates with more people. It builds your audience, so now you're on the next step. And then it kind of plateaus off for a little bit while you're documenting. You have ideas for the next big video. You're kind of working your way towards that. And then all of a sudden that video drops and it spikes again, you move up to that next level. And it, it's just kind of that incremental growth. I was talking to somebody about growth and one thing I said is I actually really don't mind that incremental growth because at least in my scenario, in my situation, it's it's a manageable growth. I can still respond to everybody in the comments. I can still try to keep up on private messages and all that kind of stuff. But I know as it gets bigger and bigger, it might get more and more difficult to do that. But you can kind of set yourself up and, and get things in place so you can keep managing it as you go from step to step to step. Just a thought I had today, it sparked from a, a conversation I had with somebody, but I wrapped up here. I'm gonna head home right now, and on the way, I'll drive down every year in Coralville, Iowa here. They line this main road, I think it's 2nd Avenue or something like that, but they just, they do up the lights really, really nicely. I'm gonna do my best to like drive down there and show you guys. I don't have the proper lens probably for it right now, but I'll do my best. I will leave you with the lights. I appreciate everybody's help and everybody reaching out and just, uh, I love where everything's going. I'm very excited about the future and I can't wait to share everything with everybody. I feel like my channel has been given this underlying purpose finally and I know what direction I wanna go. I can kind of see the vision finally and it's just i'm i'm pumped i am so pumped for it i appreciate you i appreciate everybody and i will see you tomorrow